All right, today we're going to talk about a very special uh, subject, which is how do you show people how to earn $1,000 extra per month? And we're going to talk about it three ways to do that. Now, I'm here not to show you how to earn it, although you're going to learn how to do it, but I'm here mostly to show you how do you present it to other people. Because uh, it's a fact in our business that a lot of people um, don't like the model because they believe that it's exaggerated. It's too much. All right. They just think, oh, these people are crazy. They make you dream you're going to make tons of money. But in the end, um, it's not the truth. Well, actually, I'm here to tell you that this business model allows people to earn a lot of money. We've seen people completely change their financial future. But here's the fact. Most people don't believe it works. So here's what we need to do. When you're introducing people, and guys love the, the hearts, the thumbs ups. Thanks for that. Um, and, um, you know, really cool to have this interaction here. So here's the, there's two things that are very important. When you present others how to make money in our business. One is setting the right expectations. If you don't set the right expectations, people just won't believe it's going to work. And that is the second thing. You need to make sure people believe they can do it. And that's the reason people don't join. If they don't believe they can do it, they're not going to join. You can, you can, you know, push, you can create the rah-rah, you can do anything you want. If they don't believe it's going to work for them, they're just not going to do it. All right? So, so one is... Setting the right expectations. So how do you do this? Well, when you present your compensation plan, I actually don't suggest you present the compensation plan. I suggest you present the end result of your compensation plan. Because quite frankly, do you believe that people, you know, care about the 15% on this group volume or the seven generation 5% matching bonus or you know, that they, they want to hear about the savings bonus. They don't care about these words. Those are just words. And for most people, they are complicated. They just don't connect the dots. Now, what people want to hear, and I'm going to tell you the two things they want to hear. One is they want to know how much money they can earn and what they have to do to earn it. Right? Those are the two things they want to, earn, they want to know. But more important than that is what that extra money is going to afford them. So what I mean by this is if you say, you know, I'm going to show you how to earn $1,000 a month. Well, here's the thing. They like it, but they're going to like it even more and they're really going to connect with your presentation if you give them ideas of how to spend that $1,000 extra. All right, so I'm going to show you examples of how to do this. But first, let's go back to the expectations. How do you manage the right expectations with your people? Well, when, when I'm getting someone involved in the business, even before they join the business, I want them to believe they can do it and have the right expectations before they join. So what you do is you tell them about what the numbers will be. So I'm going to give you an example. You know, if I'm presenting the business and I'm going to say, you know what, you, you've heard about this amazing product. You heard all these testimonials. You can see this is an amazing, let's say we're talking about weight loss. You know about this weight loss program. It's amazing. It's going to help a lot of people. Fantastic. Now, how do you earn money with this? Well, here's the fact. From all the people who say they want to lose weight, who pretend they want to lose weight, there's going to be about 20%. 20 to 30% of them who will actually really join and do it, all right? So that means that if you introduce 10 to 15 people to your link, you send them your link, they say, hey, I want to lose weight. Yes, send me information from those 10 or 15. You're going to get two or three who will actually buy the program and really do it. That's a fact. Now, if you present it this way, guess what happens in your prospect's mind? They start to think, oh yeah, makes sense, right? Now, how many of you have experienced wrong expectations that they just embellish everything and they make everything so crazy, 
amazing. Drop a one in the comments below. If you've ever seen someone present the business or the products in a way that's exaggerated, you know, inflated, drop a one in the comments. So, so what you want to do is that's the first thing is set the right expectations. Okay. And you do it this way just to show them, okay, it's doable. And you can give an example. One of the things you like to do is you want to support what you just said. And you just tell them just like you walk in a store because you have in mind you want to buy jeans. All right. You walk into the store and you walk out with no jeans. How come? We all know most people will not buy the jeans. Has that ever happened to you guys? Drop it to in the comments below if you walked in a store and you didn't buy what you came in for. All right. It all happens. So now you just showed your prospect who's sitting in the room or, you know, listening to your presentation that, okay, yeah, I did walk in the store, walked out, didn't buy. That happens. So now they know that if they join the business, they start to show it to other people that most people will not buy and it's normal. So now your prospect who just joined the business, who's now your partner, when they talk to two of their friends and, and they said, you're going to go and get your two or three people on board, you know, or two or three customers, and they're the first two or three they talk to, they say no. They don't get discouraged. They don't think, oh, you know, this thing doesn't work. They told me, you know, I just need to get three, but my three said no. No, they know I'm going to have to introduce 10 or 15 to get my three. Simple. Now you have people who are interested, who are committed, who know what to expect. That's the first thing, okay? So let me talk about the income now. How do you present the income? And how many of you would love to learn how to show people how to make money? Drop a three in the comments below if you want to know how to present the income to your prospect. Now, I told you the numbers, like the percentages, like 15% and then seven generations deep and the savings bonus, that's techno babble. Right? Most people don't care about these things. What they care about is, okay, what do I have to do and how much can I earn? And then more importantly, what will I do with the money? All right, and guys, I see all the numbers, one, two, and three. That's awesome. Thanks for that. And the thumbs up. I love those. That's great. Good interaction. So here's what you do. You're going to have to look at your compensation plan and figure out how much, what do they need to do to produce this kind of income and look for two or three ways to do that. Because now people will see themselves doing it one way or the other and they have different ways to do it. Okay, so figure this out in your compensation plan. Like in mine, here's what I would do. I would say, okay, for you to earn, and oh, by the way, just to make sure, you don't want to go into the crazy incomes. You don't want to say, okay, let me show you how to make 10000 a month. Most people, it's out of their reality. Okay, for most people, that's too much. All right. How many of you have seen a prospect just totally back up because they didn't believe that was something they could achieve? Drop a four in the comments below. We see that often, right? How many of your friends make, you know, 10,000 a month? Very few. Drop a four if you agree with that. So here's what you do. You, you do a ladder. You show the small numbers and then you have them imagine what would be the bigger number. Let them dream about it. Let them come up with it, okay? But make them believe that the small numbers work because they know the people who actually want to make lots of money, if they know the small numbers work, they know the big ones will work. They're not crazy. They know that. So you don't have to go and exaggerate and inflate things. Just focus on the small ones and people will start to believe more and more in what you're saying. And if they believe more and more in what you're saying, guess what's going to happen at the end of the presentation? They're going to want to join. Does that make sense? Like if you really focus on believing, getting people to believe they can do the small things, they're going to, you know, want to do the big things. Drop a five in the comments below if you agree with that. Thanks for the interaction, by the way. Um, so let me show you how to do this. You can tell people, you say, okay, you know, you, you've introduced you know, like 10 or 15 of your friends or people on social media who said, hey, I want to lose weight. You send them information you get three customers. Well, three customers, you get that this week. So that means you probably expose two people a day, right? Just send your link to two people a day that said, hey, I want to lose weight. Yeah, show me more. 
So out of those people, you're gonna get three customers and that's gonna earn you about $250. Per week, you do that every week, that's a thousand a month. That's one of the three ways to earn a thousand a month. Now, what would you do with a thousand a month? Well, what you could do is you could say, you know what, I'm gonna pay off my credit card that I've been holding on to for 10 years that I just can't pay off the capital. I'm just stuck with the interest, you know, all the time. And so maybe in a year from now, your credit card is gone. You don't have to pay it anymore. You get that thousand dollars extra coming in every month. And you also have the money you were spending on the credit card that you don't have to pay anymore. So now you may have, I don't know, $1,500 a month. How would that change your life a year from now? You know, or how about that family vacation you've been dreaming of that you just couldn't do it because you didn't have the money. And now you have $1,000 extra you put aside so you can go on that family vacation. And that's a luxury vacation, you know, maybe ten, twelve thousand dollars $12,000, right? Or maybe it's the down payment on the car that you've been dreaming of buying. You know, what would $1,000 extra per month would do for you? So do you see, guys, that that is how you create the, the, you know, the success, the imagination, all right, that people can see, wow, I want that. Okay, so, and you can even tell them, and what if it's instead of three customers a month, what, a, a week, what if it's three a month? Like how many people would totally change their life with $250 extra per month? Like $250 extra, it may be that, you know, one or two nights out with your spouse, right? It may be some money for college funds for your kids. Maybe, all right, so you can get them to believe, wow, I can get three customers a week. That's pretty simple. Share my link with two people a day. It's pretty simple. But now a month, like I can do that, all right? So you get them to believe in those different things, all right? Then you get them to dream a little bit about that. So, so you say, okay, that's it. And he, now there's probably gonna be people around you who also would love to earn some money. And they say, so what do you do? Like, I, I haven't seen you lately. You say, oh, you know, I, I show people how to make money online. And you say, really, how do you do that? And then you can introduce them to your business. Now, here's what's gonna happen. There's gonna be a lot, again, of pretenders. Those people who say, yeah, I wanna make money online, but they're not really willing to drop their te you know, preferred television program, all right? So maybe it's gonna be, again, 10 to 15 people before you get your two or three people who wanna do the business. Now, when you get three people, and let's say you do that every single day, two people you share it with, and you got three partners, and you say, hey, you know, when you start, why don't you lose some weight so that people around you notice what happened to you and you lost all this weight. And so you get on the weight loss program, you get your testimonial and there people are going to start to want to do it. And you're going to get your three customers and you're going to make it 250 bucks a week. And you know, so what happens to those people? Well, they want to get started on the weight loss program. And now you got three partners who got started and you make another 250 bucks a week and you do that every week, you got a thousand extra per month. That's the second way to earn a thousand dollars extra per month. Now you just showed people two ways to earn that and they can see, I can do this. And they have the right expectations because now they can see it's not about, you know, earning the big money and, and talking to three people and all three are gonna join. They know it's gonna be 10 or 15, right? That are serious about this. Right, so you have the right expectations. And here's the next thing you do. You, now you got your you know, two or three people on board and they start to get a couple customers and they get a couple other reps. And when your team gets to about 20, you get about a, a team of about 20, well, you're making another extra $1,000 a month. That's a third way to make that money. Now, here's what's gonna happen. Your group starts to expand, it starts to grow. Now, if you're able with a team of 20, to make a thousand extra, what happens when your team gets to a hundred? Because those people will continue and they'll also want to get their 20, right? So it keeps on growing. And then when your team gets to about a hundred, you know, that's where you make approximately a thousand, but a week instead. How would that change your life? And now, now, so now you can picture, you can create some pictures in their mind. Now, guys, do you see the progression? If you see the progression, drop a five in the comments below. You see that, that you're starting to make them believe that all these steps are doable? And here's what I'm gonna do at the end. Here's how I'm gonna close this, because I haven't talked about the comp plan at all, all right? You can see, I'm, all I'm doing is just focusing 
on them, you know, getting the money to do the things they want. Simple. All right. So what you'll do is you say now a thousand and you start to give them Im Im images of what they can accomplish with this. All right. And then you back up and you say, now all of this is great because now it's a hundred people on your team. What if it gets to a thousand people on your team? Can you see the multiplication over time? But all of this is going to work when the you, you start, you work, you make it work. And how do you make it work? Well, you start, you start to use the product, you start to get results. And then the next thing is you're going to get 10 or 15 people who say, hey, I want to lose weight, but you know, two or three will do it. And now you get, you know, two or three customers. And then when that works, now we know, okay, the small numbers work. And now we're going to go to the next level instead of us focusing on you're going to make millions. No, let's go and help you make $250 this week or this month. If that's your goal, let's focus on one, getting new results with the products and then two, getting you to 250 bucks extra. Once we do that, then we'll just start to replicate that. That's how we do the business step by step. Now, can you see how people will be much more interested in your presentation when you do it this way? Then when you do it with the big numbers and show the comp plan and all the 15 and 5% and all of these things, drop a six in the comments below. If you agree that this is a much better way to show people how to earn money with you online in a simple way than showing all the breakage and all the, the stuff on the, on the comp plan and all the complexities where it, for them, it's just overwhelming, right? just completely crazy, but we've done it and I've done it myself too, right? So you just learn a new way to present it. That's simple. And it, that would be the kind of conversation you would have with a friend and they would believe that that can work. So guys, thanks for all the, the, the heads up, the, the thumbs up and the hearts and the comments. Uh, love you guys and drop. Where are you coming from? Love to hear uh, where you guys are listening from and we'll see you on the next video. See you guys.